Well, make your pitch. Make your pitch right there to that camera. Let's hit the single for Ted Karras, Walter Payton Man of the Year, nominee, Cincinnati Bengal. Give me your best pitch to T. Higgins Gee, on why he should come back. We love you in Cincinnati. You're a dynamic player and a great teammate. And I hope that uh, the front office comes through and gives you everything you need. I, but I hope it's a big spring regardless for you. Love you, man. See you soon. Ted, we appreciate you. Okay, I need this drop. What is the one that you're wearing? You like the brown? I like the, it's, well, it's kind of like tan. Yeah. I like that. Khaki. We've got these as well. I have a bunch Do of these. Do you want the khaki? I, no, I don't know. Okay. No, I'm going to take it off of your head. But these, uh, I have an autographed one, which is absolutely amazing. Tell us what we're doing with Cincy Hass as you are sort of on this campaign of good doing that might lead you to take home some hardware tonight and NFL honors. We are nominated for the nationwide uh, Walter Payton Man of the Year. Um, started this Cincy hat really just as a token of friendship blew up. We've sold $1.2 million worth of hats. All the proceeds have gone to the Village of Marici, which is an organization that provides the infrastructure and support needed to allow adults with Down syndrome and autism to live a full and independent life. Together with neighbors and friends, it's beautiful. These hats have been able to double the impact of the village. We're whittling down the wait lists that are keep getting longer and longer. And once you're in the village, you're in for life, so. Aren't you so impressed with how this has taken off and so thankful, not only to Cincinnati, by the way, this is a nationwide effort to make and improve the lives of the people at the village. Of, uh, I'm blown away. Over 15,000 people have bought hats worldwide and I can't express my gratitude enough. And I really do hope that we win because tonight Nationwide gives $250,000 to, to the winner's charity. And that's what it's all about. Now we had Max Crosby on the show. He was talking about what it meant to him. We all heard Patrick Mahomes say there's no better award. That's a Super Bowl MVP, right? A Super Bowl winner saying there's no better or bigger award than the Walter Payton Man of the Year Award. Uh, outside of the donation, what does it mean to you? Yeah, to be considered, you know, in the same sentence as Walter Payton's sweetness, I don't even think I can express the magnitude of that. I grew up a Bears fan, so um, on all the good, <laughs> all the good that he's done, you know, off the field, set such a beautiful example for us. Um, even to be nominated with the caliber of men that are here, yeah. very honored, deeply honored. Yeah. Did you? Who was saying something about? I'm trying to think. I was gonna. I'm gonna ask T. Higgins and Jamar Chase this uh, when they're on the show. But somebody was saying that you know I think Lamar Jackson and Josh Allen are better. Have you seen this viral video better than Joe Burrow? No, I haven't seen this. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Just yeah. You want you want to address that at all? That that he's not as good as those players. He hasn't done enough in their league. What do you I don't have to think. Say about I don't that? think either of those two guys have made a Super Bowl. I know we need to. Well said. We need to go and and try and win one here, but. It's a video that's gone viral. And by the way, disturbingly, has gotten tens of thousands of likes saying Joe isn't as good as Lamar or, or Josh. And the only reason he's successful is because of those wide receivers. I think that's overblown. I mean, that's just people, that's just people talking crazy on the internet. Talk we know who crazy. Joe Burrow is and what he's about. Tough year for Cincinnati this year, but we're gonna be back. What's the uh, thing that you were looking forward to most at Super Bowl, Ted? I think coming up here and talking to UK, I want to make sure you could, could rep the hat. You're the best. Uh, <laughs> We've loved supporting Cincy Hats, as you know. You've been amazing. We did a K caught you. We you donated $1,000. It's not 250 k but at least it was something yeah, to get it rolling. That meant a lot. A lot of people talk about that at the Village. So. Amazing. Oh, We're we, big fans. We so appreciate it. Good luck. To, I'll see you at NFL Honors. We'll be there. I got it. It's insane. It is the most magical, amazing night. I mean, you said you grew up a Bears fan. We have DJ Moore uh, coming on the